Right, so earlier on then we fitted the suspension arms in on, on, on the bike and if you remember we spoke about the bolts and the bolts have got slightly bigger but longer bolts there than at the bottom um, and the, again the reason they are is because as we begin to put the mudguard on and the mudguard stays come together then they'll all be bolted on and so there's a big bolt that goes through this and goes through the mudguard there bolt down here for the mudguard two bolts at the top and then the mudguard stays will come from the back and they'll be able to get it so I'll just go get the mudguard so um, this is the mudguard as I've just said this is the long bolt that goes all the way through um, so I'll just undo it And take it out. So the mud guard whoa, goes onto the bike like so. And we don't want to scratch the mud guard at all and fits there. And the big long bolt goes all the way through. So I've been and got the mud guard stays and they're just identical, there's no left or right one, they're both the same, they have a little indentation on them um, and I'll show you where that goes and they're both exactly the same and I have to say the painter guy has done a really good job and so how they're going to go is they're going to go from the bolt and they're going to go across onto the bottom of the, mud, the, uh, the mud guard like that. So we'll just undo the, the nut at the top of the suspension mounting and we'll slide the first one on and the indentation can you see it there it's got a little kink in it just there it's going to go against there so the indentation onto the mudguard and I don't want it falling off so I'll just put it on very lightly so that it don't fall off and scratch the paintwork and then the second one the indentation to the outside so the indentation has got a little kink on goes to the outside of the mudguard onto it and again spring washer and nut just do it loosely then I'll just go around and I'll do the other side so we're just doing the other side now and again the indentation as you can see it's got a little kink in it probably too close to the camera there goes on and we'll just put that nut back on the bolt just so this doesn't fall off and we scratch anything and we'll put the last mudguard stay at the bottom put the nut on and the indentation the kink is that 
so it's there, so it flushes up against the, the mud guard. There you go, feel it not go home nice and scrubbing. Spring washer and nut. And just nip it on so it's nice and job done. There you go, so we know that it's on nice and square, we know everything's been pulled up there, It'll keep it straight, just do a quick visual check to make sure that it's done on, in, in line with everything and so far so good. Now let's do the seat. 